For our next headline, we head to Cyril. The tiny town about an hour southwest of Oklahoma City has been thrown into turmoil after four-year-old Athena Brownfield disappeared there nearly a week ago. New today, the Oklahoma State Bureau of Investigation says they're now searching for that little girl's body. 2 News Oklahoma's Jeanette Quesada joins us in studio with new details on the investigation. Jeanette? Well, Naomi, tomorrow will be exactly one week since the search for little Athena Brownfield began. Her two caregivers are now in custody. One is facing a first a, a murder charge. Today, the agency is giving more details on how Athena is connected to the suspects. After a weekend vigil, the surreal community uniting in solidarity. The hope to find four-year-old Athena Brownfield alive has vanished. Investigators are now looking for her remains. This story is so impactful and how many people care about this child, want to see her returned and, you know, people are phoning in those tips from across the country um, and we're just, we're following everything. The investigation began on January 10th when a mail carrier discovered Athena's five-year-old sister alone outside a home in Cyril. Since then, multiple law enforcement agencies and dozens of volunteers have searched for the missing girl. At this point, the investigation into her whereabouts continues. We are actually getting tips from across Oklahoma as well as multiple other states. Monday, we learned the caregivers who are in jail are related to Athena and her sister and have been taking care of the girls for the last year. Our analysts and our team of multiple law enforcement agencies are reviewing surveillance video from around town and again pursuing any tip that comes in, following it up and um, trying to identify any clues that can be used to locate Athena. Alicia Adams was arrested in Oklahoma last Thursday. That same day, her husband Ivan was arrested in Phoenix, Arizona. Court documents say agents found undisclosed evidence on Ivan's cell phone. The OSBI says the girl's biological parents are cooperating with the investigation. We're praying for her family and her relatives. Um, and for the investigators who are looking for her. These new details are drawing eyes from across the nation. While we always hope and pray that the tragedies of the world will never impact our lives and communities, this event has placed our loving community into the spotlight of the nation. And the community teamed up with law enforcement over the last week to search for Athena. But tonight, OSBI is asking the public to stand down. They say searching for her could be considered trespassing or even interfere with the investigation by contaminating potential evidence. If you have any information, please contact the OSBI tip line at 800 522 You can remain anonymous. Live in studio, Janet Quesada, 2 News, Oklahoma.